more learning self-realization with real realization. Now, let's start one story. Once upon a time, there was a king who made a beautiful palace using crystal, glasses, prism, diamonds. This palace was shining in the day as like gold, gold palace. And in the night, it looks like silver, diamond. Everyone who visited this palace and when he saw the beauty of this palace, he wanted to become an owner of this palace. One day, the king who made this palace conveyed to all countrymen that those who wanted to become an owner of this palace, he has to complete one challenge. And if he accepted and completed this challenge, I would forward my palace ownership to that person. And what was that challenge? Very simple. Dog. Those countrymen have its own dog and this dog could get in the center room and here there is a flash and come back without any hurt. Means completely in a, this exercise should be in a relaxed mood by the dog. So when this hurt by countrymen, every people reach to the that palace and said his dog. When dog entered into that palace, he found thousands of dog. And of course dog has its own animosity. And uppermost, when he saw thousand dogs, he come back. And never wanted to go in that palace. Some are courageous. They entered into the that palace and found that thousand dogs and animosity in the uppermost and forward and attack on that dogs but that dogs its own image and this image also attack on him in a thousand way and then there is a problem of hurting that dog wounded by glass and nobody accepted the challenge in the right way. All dogs hurt whether they are not able to go or hurt him themselves. That's the problem. Nobody completed that challenge. And after a long time, a simple man came and told to the king that, Sir, I would like to accept this challenge. King gave uh, give permission and he sent his dog and dog enter into that room. All countrymen are seeing the, uh, this and found that that this dog take a flash and outside there is no problem at all. What happened? All countrymen, those who dream for that palace <coughs> saw what happened. This man did this job in a very little way, in a very simple way. What happened? And then King, when King asked this man, how did you accomplish this great challenge in a very simple way? This man is a philosopher man. He told sir, I found that there is a problem with this, all dogs that they have attributes of animosity. So I took, I take my dog and give, learn, give knowledge, knowledge of self-realization. I always took him and saw the mirror. When I saw the mirror in first time, he found that there is a huge dog in front of him and he wanted to kill him. But after slowly and slowly, I <coughs> gave this knowledge that what you see in front of you, this is your own image, not any other dog image. 
so he convert transform transition his knowledge into a divine knowledge and he know that <coughs> this is my own image why i should hurt these images and he convert his nature of animosity and he unanimously go under the that palace and he found that thousands of dogs around him and change his behavior he now loved each one when he loved each one then thousands of dogs whose own images loved him and he greatly with the <coughs> successful he greatly take the that that objective in a very easy way this is the objective of all us a simple dog learn that all images of his own why we are more intellectual we are more knowledgeable who regards that that we are very intelligent but we are lack of love we are not imagining other person that this is the shape of myself if you make your life with love passionate compassion with others definitely you will get the same reflection and dear friends let us preach what we teach or what we practice let us preach what we practice and let us practice what we preach and our all the scripture said this one that the whole universe is of your own image love them not hate them not shoot them not any on them but love each you will find a love from them and your life is like a heaven not hell this is our toastmaster